Hey guys, Fun Master Link here. I'm gonna be playing some more uh, Lunar today, tonight. Uh, went ahead and I got some uh, got some experience and money, so thought I should probably do that before before I get into it. I'm not okay, that's yeah. That, oh, I, I see, I see. Yeah, I think I have to go uh, south to Haram. I think it's called. This must be Haram. Or no, that's that one town where we met fucking uh, Ronfar. Maybe it's over here then. Maybe. What the hell is this thing? We can't get through here. Oh, the only way is to break the shield with the dragon power. Okay. Great. I just know they said the shit was south, so I don't... Pentagilly is there. Can I get through there? What's going on? Oh, okay, we're on land? Cool, I guess. Um... Oh no, it's a frog! Everyone run! Run quickly before he licks you! But how's it going, frog? How long have I been on? Uh... As of now, two minutes. So, you didn't really miss much at all. What the hell is this ugly bastard here? What is that? Oh, that's that shrine thing, isn't it? Have I, have I been to this thing before? What is this? Yeah, so Frog, uh, I spent a bit of time before starting to stream. Um, I got uh, some more money and more XP. Because I knew I needed uh, both. Especially the money, because I wasted a bunch on, uh, on shit. Oh, I remember that. The Dragon Ruins. Yeah, that was at the very start of the game, wasn't it? Totally forgot of that thing. Okay. Yeah, let's, uh... I kind of feel like going to visit Grandpa. I mean, he's not too far off, is he? I'm trying to get my way to Haram, I think it's called. They said it was south, but... I don't know if there's, uh... Hey, there's Grandpa's house. Might as well say hi, I, I guess. Shit. Alright, there's Grandpa. Here I'm a boy. You're a sight for sore eyes. Did you get to see did, did you get to see the goddess Althena? What? The goddess has been sealed away? That's insanity. You must do something to help her, hero. And I guess that's it for him. Okay. Just gonna get out of here then, leave grandpa to his to his wanking. Three hot young chicks. Might be too much for an old dude's ticker. Um if he was Master Roshi, yeah, probably, but I doubt his dick works like Master Roshi's does, so he should be fine. You know, one thing I never quite understood about Master Roshi, like, if he wanted a woman so bad, couldn't he just, like, buy a, a live-at-home hooker or something like that? I, I never... I never understood that reasoning, you know? Like, I, I don't know how rich he is, but I he has to have some kind of money if he, uh... If he gets, you know, like, food and electricity and, and fucking TV service all the way over there. What the fuck is this shit here? What is this? I don't think I've ever been to this thing. Oh, this is that one tower, isn't it? Yeah. We already... I, I think that's when, um... That's the first boss we actually faced. Okay, maybe I'm not supposed to use the Dragon Ship Destiny? Can't go over mountains. It can go across seas, though.
Where the hell does this go? I just know that I'm supposed to go south. That's all. That's the only thing I know. Oh, I think, yeah, I've been through this forest before, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. You see, now that the game's, like, semi-open up, since I have this goddamn, um... Since I have this, you know, boat-slash-uh-vehicle. But what is that? I don't know what that thing is up there, either. What is that? Like, that structure in the middle of this forest? I, mean, I don't really want to check it out. I'd rather, I'd rather just ignore it. <laughs> uh, there are bad guys here. Fuck that. Oh, great. What's going on Discord again? Man, those fucking nerds. They're, they're in a group chat right now being all weird and shit. Is that the hot spring? No, it don't look like it. It looks like some kind of fortress in the middle of the forest. It is not a hot spring. I'm just trying to figure out where the fuck I'm going. Well, let me go back to where the first cave was, because I, I know, um... What's her nuts keeps uh, bitching about, about something. Ruby keeps complaining about something. Unless, am I just supposed to go? Where does where does this go? I'm just curious, is this a town or anything? It's, it's just another forest. No, oh, yeah, I remember this forest. I remember that. Yeah. Oh, so one thing that was kind of interesting, I guess it was just kind of a happy accident where I'm just like a genius like that. So, uh, those Shiro mongrels, those like packs of dogs or whatever. So it turns out, uh, there's a rare chance for there to spawn a, something called a Shiro mongrel. And sure enough, I tried to use the thief staff on the Shiro mongrel. Um, uh, because it has like super high defense, so I couldn't really kill it before it ran away. And I managed to get a Chiro, uh, Chiro Crest. C-H-I-R-O. So I have two Chiro Crests now. So that's pretty cool. Oh. Oh, I, okay, now I found the way to go. I was like, what the way? Yeah, I must not have seen that over there. This is definitely a new town. I have not been here before. This must be it. Good. What do they do in tandem? Well, let's find out. Because, uh, I haven't fucked around too much with the combinations yet. So let's see what two Chiro Crests do. I'm, I'm curious about that. So, oh, that's actually a pretty good boat, a uh, boost. So two Chiro Crests on the same character, it says speed is greatly increased and the user always attacks first. So it's like a kind of a, what do they call it, like a preemptive strike like they say in Final Fantasy. That's actually kind of a good technique. That's actually kind of a good technique. Um... So a Chiro and Chiro Crest. Speed is slightly increased, range is greatly increased. I think I have that on for uh, for uh, Ronfar right now, actually. Okay, nothing combination with the uh, that I have with the the current Chiro Crest. But still, that's kind of cool. I uh, I think I might actually give um because one thing I like about Genus like her different dances. Because, like, a, a lot of groups, like, pack kind of enemies, like dogs or whatever, they like to stay in place, like, at the very start of the fight. And so what I'll have with Jean is, since her MP isn't really used for anything else, 
I'll have it like she'll use like a like a dance to like confuse the enemy or put a, put them to sleep. If she always attacks first, then that can pretty much guarantee that I can preemptively strike a bunch of enemies, put them to sleep, or poison or what have you. But yeah, that is pretty dope. Oh, I forgot to do this last. Uh, I forgot to do this in the first place. Uh, Non-attribute magic enables thunder, wind, combination magic. I kind of want to see what that does. Oh, and the white dragon crest enables white dragon power, or white dragon protect. I, I should probably put that on um, what's his nuts hero. Hey, Ronfar, what do you have? Two Shiro Crest together, okay. Probably stick with that, I guess. Yeah. Because, like, I, I noticed when I was grinding for some XP, like, his... His, uh, his movement is definitely increased with those two Shiro Crests. Because he hit a guy, like, damn near all the way on the left side of the damn screen. Okay, so... Do I really want to get rid of the power in the Warrior Crest, though? I don't know. Oh, well, wait. Well, well, let's see. Power Crest. Powers. Powers of other Crest Worn. Does that include the special dragon ones, by chance? Maybe. I mean, it only lowers my attack by 10, so... I'm willing to... I'm willing to do that. I mean, we're about to get a power-up anyway from all the money that we have. Chiro? Chiro plus Warrior? Uh, that's what I had on there to begin with. Because the Warriors raise your attack up, and the other one, like, raises the effect of that one. Like, that's, that's what I, I had it right now, just until a second ago. I got 20,000 silver, I expect to set- I expect to pay for it in this town. Welcome to Haram, the city of martial arts and the birthplace of the Dr Blue Dragon Fist. Have you come to witness the upcoming tournament? It's the it's first to be held in many months. Uh, yeah, sure. Whatever. I mean, it all just seems like a big, fat waste of time, man. No matter how much I train, man, I'm always getting the crap kicked out of me, man. I want to be a martial artist, man. Not a human punching bag. This sucks, man. Okay. I guess they're going to hold a martial arts tournament. I'd be more excited. But they're not allowing any spectators, so what's the point? Well, I mean... Sucks to be you? I don't know. Why is Lord Lun... Ah, uh, no, no, never mind. It's nothing. I've always been a fan of Lun, so I came here to, scu to I came here to study martial arts and emulate my hero. Well, that's kind of a $2 word, isn't it? Emulate? But I've heard some strange rumors since I got here, and I haven't seen Lun anywhere. For some reason, I'm worried. This is no place to train. Okay. Ooh, I got a protection ring. Hidden behind a house there, secretly. I came to Haram because I heard... They're about to hold a martial arts tournament. The way I figure it, the man who wins the tournament is the strongest man in the world. And that's the and that's the man I intend to marry. So when does this tournament thing get started? Uh, honey, what if the guy who wins the tournament is a big, strong, ugly imbecile? I think you should be on the lookout for a guy with brains and brawn. Me, for example. Uh-huh. I want to be just like Lun, the king of the blue dragon fist. That's why I came to Haram. But the guys in the Blue Dragon Dojo won't let me enroll. What are you, Krillin? You know, kind of like the monks never let him. Never mind. No one probably gets the reference. They probably won't even talk about Master Lun. What's up with that, I ask you? Master Lun has been virtually unstoppable lately. He seems to be thriving upon his victories. I suppose it's natural for a martial artist of his caliber to thirst for success. Yeah, Jane has thoughts about that. Yeah, hint, you can enter the tourney. No, really? You know what would be kind of fucking funny? Is if we went into the tourney and there's actually... Like, the first guy we face is like a... Is like a Bruce Lee kind of wannabe. I mean, Dragon Ball did shit like that all the time. This is the dojo, the Blue Dragon Fist. This Blue Dragon Fist dojo is the whole mountain that... Sums up the martial arts from throughout the world. Okay. Hero, what's wrong with this guy? He's not moving and his eyes are all glazed over. I think we ought to come back to this one later. Okay. Interesting. Uh, let's check out 
some of the shops, I guess. Let's check out this item shop. Shouldn't really need much, honestly. Because, uh... I mean, I, I bought the shit I wanted. Wait, what? Oh, you can actually buy fucking Warrior Crest and Power Crest here? Well, that's pretty fucking cool. Huh. I did I did not know you could do that. I mean, they're, they're somewhat reasonably priced, I guess. So the Warrior Crest is 4,000. 4, the Power Crest is 3,500. Huh. So, Gene should have two Churro Crests in the tourney. Two Warrior Crests in tandem. I mean, if she's literally the only one who can compete in the tournament, which I kind of figure, then I... I guess I'll... I'll tailor her shit up. Because, I mean, she wants to be... Gotta be the strongest. Okay, bitch also sells a protection ring. That's cool, too. Actually, I might give that to, to Jean. I, thought, I think I found a protection ring just a second ago, didn't I? Should probably buy some healing nuts. Let's buy at least six of them, I guess. Let's buy a bunch of herbs. I might as well max out on herbs. The herbs are so they're so cheap. There we go. Uh, please stop in again. Like, I'm actually getting kind of bummed out the fact that I'm not really getting any jobs in my field. Like, even remotely, uh... Like, being looked at. It. Well, except for that, um, that one place in Salina. But, the, I mean, I don't even want to work for them the way that their fucking application pro process was set up. It's fucking stupid. Come on in and buy one of our weapons. Guaranteed to kill your money back. Actually, that's not entirely true, but I sure do sell more weapons when I say that. I'm sure you do. Man, some of these look fucking cool, dude. I think the Platinum Blade here already has, yeah. Samurai Sword? I can fight with Honor? Hell yeah, dude. I love Honor and shit. Do two Warrior Crests confer extreme attack benefits? Oh, you're saying have two warrior crests to see what it does. Um, I mean, I can buy that. I can buy that warrior crest if I have enough money. But I, I'm gonna blow through this twenty, this twenty thousand silver pretty fast, though. I mean, you can bet your ass I'm buying a samurai sword for hero. I mean, that's just, that's just obvious. I mean, come on. Flying flail, mighty mace for martial artists. Do martial arts artists use flails? Okay. Yeah, we'll get that for Ronfar there. Equip those bad boys and sell the old ones. Why do I still have this rune sword? I need to sell that shit. I don't even know why I have it on me. Yeah, equip that. Equip that samurai sword. Equip that, uh, flail. And get a bit back from the rune sword, platinum blade. Give her that ritual mace. Yeah, I'm still gonna save all the staffs, I guess. I probably shouldn't, but... I think I can sell the magic gauntlets, though. Yeah. Okay. Hey, thanks a lot! Okay, so... What do you got here? Warrior shield? Is that... St okay, we finally... Wait, what? Oh my god. Huh. <laughs> the, the warrior shield is actually still worse than the legendary lid that I have on overall. Like, with this warrior shield, I get 11 more defense, but everything goes down, like, 2 points. So... I mean, I'd rather probably just keep the legendary lid still, honestly. Gotta be jeweled bracelet? Uh, 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 I might actually skip out on that. Suggest saving and buying it if it does, if it doesn't, if it does squat, reload. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that in a sec. Okay, jewel gauntlet. I don't, yeah, I was about to say, I think I just bought some in the last town. I don't need that shit. Warrior armor. 
144 to 152. Yeah, that's probably worth getting. Damn, a warrior helm, too? That looks kind of sick. Ritual hairpin. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I put those on there for a reason. You know what? Hold on a sec. I'll, I'll come back to this armor shop. I'm just curious about that warrior thing you were talking to me about. Let's uh, make me a save real quick. make sure I don't actually have two of those already. Power warrior, power warrior. Okay, yeah, I just have one of each. Okay. So, I just want to see what happens if I have two. I mean, if I have two power crests, it says powers up other crests worn. If I have two of those on, like, that seems kind of worthless, doesn't it? But let's see what the two, uh, the two ones that increase attack do. Oh, okay. No, I was wrong. So two power crests, um, all characters, all character abilities are slightly increased. And it actually gives a, a pretty decent buff to everything, too. Like, attack goes up a little, defense goes up a little. Same with agility, speed, wisdom, magic, defense, range. Huh. Okay. The, the two warrior crests, let's see what those do together. Oh, that actually does not have a uh, combo. Well, uh, okay, I mean, it just says Warrior Crest, two of those. It says attack is, is slightly increased, but that, I mean, that's what it does anyway. It increases attack by... Oh, wow, it actually increases the attack by 20. That's... That's kind of worth it. Like, on, on Hero, it has his attack from 154 to 174. Maybe I should just buy two, uh, another Warrior Crest just for Jean to have on. And maybe give her a protection ring or two. Hmm. That would be a good idea. But yeah, I don't think I need the two uh, Warrior Crest things for now. Wait a sec. Warrior crest attack is slightly increased. Okay, yeah, for, for Jean's sake, if she's competing in the tournament, I'd rather she have 20 more attack. If it's just her by herself, I'd rather have that than have everything else buffed a little bit with the two power crests. Okay, let me reload my thing. I suggest keeping two churro on Jean for tourney, for reasons. Mm. If you say so. I mean, I assume I can buy these things at any time, so. But yeah, Jean actually has the two churro crests on her right now. The one that gives you uh, increased, greatly increased speed, and the user always attacks first, which I think is pretty sweet. Because of her little dances and shit. Consider if she always goes first, she can use healing items before she gets hit. I mean that, and if I'm getting ganked, I can use a, I can use maybe a dance to like poison him or something. Like that'd be pretty sweet. But how's it going, uh, Nozig? I don't know how to pronounce your name, but hope you're doing well tonight on this Sunday night. 
or Monday morning, depending on where you live. How do I get two Chiros? Uh, so the I actually kind of discovered it myself. Um, if you go to the uh, the ice place where you do the the white dragon trial, um, there are these enemies there called uh, Chiro mongrels, um, and there's actually a small chance for something called a Chiro mongrel to appear in the pack with them. Um, now, since he has like really high defense and he runs away easily, I couldn't actually kill him for his for his crest because he drops it. Because like his name is is Chiro, you know. So what I actually did is Lemina actually has this staff called the Thieves Staff, uh, which basically acts like a steel move, I guess. So I just had her use the Thieves Staff staff on the on the Chiro mongrel, and that's how I got a second crest. It was pretty fucking cool. I was I was quite hyped about it. Let me go back to... Let me get some armor here. I pronounced correctly. How did you kill them? They're super tough. Wow, I never thought of doing that. Big brain move. Two Chiros are amazing. Yeah, I'm going to put them on Jean because uh, I think she's going to be in a tournament here pretty soon. But yeah, I'm kind of surprised at how brilliant I was thinking that. Um... Like, I don't know if it's a common thing for all these crests to be named after certain individuals that you can steal it from. Like, like the, the like the warrior crest. Is there, is there an enemy called warrior in the game? I don't know. Um, I just, I, I only knew about this because I was killing a bunch of those. There's a lot of those uh, Shira mongrels in that ice cave for Null's trial or whatever. And, uh... And, like, I actually got a Shiro Crest as a drop from one group, and I'm like, oh, is that because it's in the name? Blah, blah, blah. So that led me to think, oh, maybe I can use this Thief Step to actually, like, take it from enemies with their corresponding names. I'm still kind of learning this combination system, really. But it's pretty cool. Like, they, they really should have had this in the first game. Uh, yeah, you bet your ass we're gonna buy that warrior armor. Buy that. I can't really buy any armor for Jean, unfortunately. Well, how good is that jewel gauntlet? Oh, she already has one. Dummy. Let's buy the holy clothes to Varonfar. Let's buy the immortal robe for Mina. Oh yeah, that's a good robe. That's a good robe. And screw it. One more. We'll buy the warrior helm for Hero, I guess. Well, you can buy a warrior and power crest. Two Chiros are very good on Lamina while killing monsters in the dungeon. You can attack with her fist. You can attack with her first to weaken the enemies. Oh, that's true. I mean, I was thinking of just innately, even before coming to this town, I was like, oh, maybe I could put these two on uh, Jean to make it so that I can instantly, like, uh, use one of her uh, debuff, like, you know what I mean, dances on a group of enemies. Because I've noticed certain type of uh, certain type of mobs, they'll like kind of huddle up close together at the start of every fight, no matter what. Yeah, Gene, we're, you're gonna have to wear that uh, protection ring for sure. Put that thing on. I guess I'll have her keep the healing ring. I guess. Or wait. Oh, I was I was on the wrong one. <laughs> I was on the wrong person. We want to. Yeah, put your luck down. Who cares about luck? I guess we'll give her the Gorgon doll for the magic defense. Okay. So, yeah. Shit, you know what? You might as well put on that ritual hairpin. Screw it. Okay. And we're basically broke now. Oh wait, I, I never sold my shit, did I? Hold on a second. I gotta make sure everyone has shit equipped. Yeah, put on your holy clothes. Put on your immortal robe. Okay. There we go. Sell that shit. 
Gene always goes. Gene always goes first anyway. That's right. The better use. That's right. She better use protection when facing Lun. Yeah, she's gonna get fist to death. Do healing rain stack? You never tried using two. I think they do. I think they do. I'll have to. I'll have to actually test that out in the field. But it seems like you heal more when you have two uh, healing rings on you. Okay, so we want to sell light armor, ceremonial clothes, magician robe, steel helm. Uh. We'll keep the we'll keep the keep the cute ribbon for a little little bit longer. Okay, got six thousand now. That's probably fine. Go and save over this shit. Okay. Oh. It'd be cool if I could just steal the steal the chest there, you know, open that shit up. It's probably where they keep their life savings, I would imagine. Okay, cool. Let's talk to more of these dicks, I guess. Tell me, have you heard of Bunny Karate? Uh, no. Sounds like gay shit to me. Unfortunately, you owe it to yourself to see Bunny Karate in action. I'm sure there are stronger martial arts, but Bunny Karate is easily the most beautiful. <laughs> okay. Just thinking about the first time I saw a bunny fighter in action makes me tingle. Uh, okay. Sounds like someone's got a... Got a, got a heart on for bunny karate. Part of me, you want to know why I'm staring at the, staring into the sky? It's part of my training. You see, by looking at the blue star, I reach a state of perfect calm. Okay. Fair enough. Everyone in Haram is excited about the upcoming tournament. The dojo that wins the tourney will be the most popular school in Haram for years to come. Okay. Martial arts have flourished here in Haram ever since the town was funded. The dojos of Haram have produced too many famous martial artists to count. Okay. Yeah, I already, I already talked to you. Shut up. Oh, that's, yeah, that's the guy that his eyes are glossing over. Okay, probably dead or something. Am I liking the game so far? Yeah. Yeah, it's quite fun. I think just because like um, the the beginning part isn't as rough because you don't have a totally useless uh, character like uh, Ramus in the first game, uh, that combined with I, it seems like you have like way more abilities in this game, like you know the fact that they kind of like evolve when you hit a, hit a certain level. Like nothing in the first game was was close to that. Like you pretty much got all the spells by level thirty. You know, and I like the the crest combination shit. I think that's cool. So I, I think I actually like this game a bit more, uh, just in terms of the actual gameplay story wise. Uh, I'd say the first one was actually a bit better. Like I haven't seen any kind of like beautiful, gorgeous cutscene. You know what I mean? I don't know. Maybe it's just because I like Luna more because she sings better. Maybe that's why. I don't know. Yeah, he's got a heart on for the bunnies. Yugi's grandpa was pretty cool. Yeah, he was neat. I'm the master of this dojo. If you want to challenge me, I'm always ready for you. I will show you that I can run away from any kind of attack. Ha ha ha. But you can't fight if you try if you run away. Exactly. If I if I do not fight, I cannot lose. That is why wind karate is the perfect technique. Oh, uh, that's a karate I should master, guys. It might, it might, it might help me when I visit Toledo again. Gasp! I need a break. Pant. The master is in great shape. He's been running all day, and he's not winded at all. What a good idea! Hero runs to stay in shape too. You don't understand. The master isn't exercising. He's pretending to run away from his opponents. <laughs> Welcome to our dojo. Do you wish to enroll, or are you here to fight? If you come here to fight, prepare yourself for defeat. We never lose. Our martial art is called Wind Karate, and it is unmatched. Probably. <laughs> I told you the really cool shit is coming later. It's like, bro, I'm already, like, fucking 35. Like, when's it coming? I mean, we are we are on disc 2 now, because I, I expect them to step it up. The hell's in here? What's in this house? Tournament is close at hand, but the teacher and all the students are sick. 
If we were healthy, we could defeat Loon, Lun, and gain instant fame. What a shame. If Lun had dared enter our dojo, we would have snapped him like a twig, but of course, he was too afraid to show himself, and I was ready to hand him his spleen, too. If, if you're so upset about it, why don't you go and beat him yourself? Well, you see, I'm even sicker than my students. <laughs> I'm the master of this dojo. I can beat anyone, including that wimp, Lun. <laughs> yeah, he's a total fucking pussy, right? I've been waiting here for him, but he hasn't shown up because he's afraid, and he should be. If you're that confident, why don't you just go find him? Well, unfortunately, I've caught a nasty cold and can't go outside. Doctor's orders. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, I'm sure. FML, you would have you would have a style called trash karate? Probably. There's still a lot of stuff. I mean, the fact that they have three discs instead of two, I expect some cool-ass cutscenes, because I... Oh, we just got a pair of blue pajamas? Cool. I rolled in this dojo to learn karate, but all I've done since I got here is make meals. My teacher tells me that's all part of my training, but I know he's a liar. They put me on cooking duty because I'm the only one in this dojo who knows how to cook. This dojo is the best in the village. Not because of the training, though. It's the food. Our chef only uses the freshest ingredients to prepare the finest cuisine I've ever had. And as you can see, I've had more than my share of it, but I'm, I'm sure I'll lose the weight. Man, you should do that Athlean X shit. That's what I'm doing. And I fucking hate it, but... You know, like Dragon was telling me, you know, I might as well hit the gym or, or learn shit while I'm in between jobs, so, you know. It still sucks, though. <laughs> I actually was looking ahead, like, the, the first week of this program or whatever. It seems to be kind of like a day-on-day-off day sort of thing, so that that's at least good. So, yeah. I think there's another house over here, right? Probably another style. The harder you drink, the harder you fight. This is the principle of the Drunken Fist Dojo. Okay. What is, uh, is Bo Raicho? Is he the master here? Which I'm surprised I even remember who that guy is. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Bo Raicho, he is a, uh, fighter from Mortal Kombat. And he actually uses, like, the Drunken Fist technique. Little fun fact, I guess. I don't really know Mortal Kombat, but I remember him. We only accept those who are willing to train fervently. Those who come here with the sole intention of bow guarding our hooch are immediately ejected. Oh my god. Funny shit, funny shit. Or potential dirty jokes, drunken fist. Uh, yeah. Indeed. That's a, probably a, that's probably a hidden technique passed, you know, passed down through, you know, ten generations frogs, so might not want to spill the beans about that. Oh, this guy is fucking drunk as a skunk here. Hi, you guys think you can beat me, huh? I'm a master of the drunken fits, folks. Somebody give me another drink. Yeah, that's it. Look. Five words for you, buddy. No one to say when. Fuck off, he can do what he wants. He's old. Most people think that students of the Drunken Fist are stronger fighters when they drink. But the truth, is, the, the truth is that we never, well, almost never drink. We only pretend to be intoxicated. Huh? But that old man was completely plastered. Haha, <laughs> it's no surprise that the Drunken Master fooled you. Take another look at his bottle of booze. It's not alcohol inside, it's just water. I mean, I knew... <laughs> I mean, I know that the Drunken Fist, it's just supposed to... Okay, my understanding is the technique... You're not actually intoxicated, you're just trying to mimic, like, the unpredictability of a drunken person. That's how I understand it. Although in anime, uh, they, they tend to kind of make up whatever they want. I mean, hell, I remember there was a guy in, in um, there was a guy in fucking Yu Yu Hakusho, he got drunk, he got piss-ass drunk, I think his name was Jin. Yeah, like the liquor, like the, like the alcohol Jin. Um, he drank, like, a bunch of shit, um, uh, and it, and it, like, didn't make him drunk per se, it made him sick. 
but like it was like a catalyst of how he like unleashed his true power basically. Like it's kind of like a double-edged sword of sorts, a drunken sword. Ooh, a life jewel, nice. There's a Jackie Chan movie about that, you think? About a drunk person fighting? Probably. I'm sure there's a lot of martial arts films that are that are about that. You know what I should do? I should watch more uh more Ip Man, because that's what that's what this shit is reminding me of. Because I, I really like the first two Ip Man films. I know they made a couple more. And on that same note, I should probably watch uh more. I've only ever seen like one or two Bruce Lee films. I'm trying to remember what was the one I saw. Wasn't it called, like, Death? Tournament of Death or something? Death Tournament? I remember seeing that, and I liked it. God, I don't remember what it was called. Have you heard the tale of why these ramparts were built around our town? One reason t was to avoid needless conflict with others. Martial arts are meant to strengthen both the body and the mind. These ramparts remind us that to pursue, that, that to pursue conflict is to weaken the soul. They won't let me pass. I don't suppose there's anything on the other side of this. I see another treasure chest. I'll grab that in a sec. Okay, I just went around the entire town, basically. There's, there's nothing else here. Let me check. Another guy here. Uh, Just some weirdo practices his scream. Uh, I'm not in the mood to scream, so... I didn't bother. Oh my god, it's a funky. Hopefully he's not playing his fucking Final Fantasy XIV bullshit. There are two Jackie Chan drunken master movies? Okay. There were only two Bruce Lee films, as far as you know? Uh, I thought he made, like, six. Like, I know he died in the middle of one that was, that was made, but... Huh. Yeah, anyway, I guess that's that's all the town. Let me go get that chest real quick, and then I'll be getting in there. Oh, it's a herb? Oh, okay, since I maxed out on herbs, he's just like, forget it! I ain't got room for that. Oh wow, <laughs> Frog is so impressed by, by my big brain moment. He's actually, he's actually, uh, he's actually letting Funky know to flex, I guess. Oh, you're playing Pokemon Arceus? Okay. Cheer Crest thing you actually heard, been here since the beginning. I had a big, ba a big brain boy. I'm a big brain boy today, guys. Maybe it's because I actually like worked out and it got like, like more blood rushing to my head, you know, it started like the chemicals up and shit. My cognitive functions. I don't know. This is the dojo of the Blue Dragon Fist, the greatest of all martial arts. You wish to study our discipline, which would make you look much wiser than you look. Bitch! Eat a dick. Enter the inner dojo and speak with Wong Lee. Okay. <laughs> sure. Be respectful in the pastor's presence. Oh boy. Pretty cool dojo, though. Is there no one among you with the strength of heart to enter the tournament and face Lun? I I'm just trying to think, like, th this guy's voice actor should be, like, the, the announcer from Dragon Ball. You know what I mean? The guy who always wears, like, the sunglasses and shit. He's like, at the World Martial Arts Tournament! You know? That'd be hilarious. Don't you understand if one wins the very tournament that I challenged him to enter? Then we are acknowledging the Shadow Dragon Fist as the ultimate martial art. I'm sorry, Master, but I can't forget what happened a month ago. None of us can. We were helpless to stop Lun as he defeated every one of our teachers, including you. How are we supposed to defeat Lun when we are mere students? Damn it, if one we had more strength, we could beat Lun. I know we could. 
No, strength alone is not the way to conquer an opponent. We use strength, we might as well use the Shadow Dragon Fist ourselves. I, I can't really tell who's talking, so. The true strength, the truth strength of mar martial arts comes from the heart. One was taught that, but he still doesn't understand, because it sucks. It's unavoidable now. I must fulfill my responsibility, my duty, as Lund's teacher. Yeah, you're gonna kill him. Probably. That's, that's what I would do. Wang Li is very worried about Master Lun. Lun fooled all of us into thinking he was devoted to the Blue Dragon Fist. When we showed his true colors, Wang Li tried to make him see reason. But Lun wouldn't listen to Wang Li. He even called his former teacher a fool. What a bitch. <laughs> I always thought it was kind of funny how, like, um... I like, you know, Goku and the other Z Fighters. Like, they're far, far, far more powerful than Master Roshi, yet they, they still, like, treat him with respect. I mean, they can blow up, you know, they could, if they wanted to, they could blow up, like, universes, or, uh, galaxies if they wanted to. But they can't be bothered, I guess. But yeah, Master Roshi, gotta respect the Master. Good old Turtle Homer. Heard of him. It's no exaggeration to say that every martial artist in Haram wants to be like him. How can a hero to so many become an enemy to all? The Blue Dragon Fist is said to have originated a thousand years ago. There have been many factions of... Uh, Blue Dragon Karate over the centuries, both honorable and dishonorable. Most of the Dark Arts were snuffed out in short order. But how is it possible that the Shadow Dragon Fist survived? Uh -huh. Wang Li still has faith that Lun can be saved. After what I saw, I'm not so confident. Master Lun studied in this dojo for many years, learning the art of the Blue Dragon Fist. But then he moved to the city of Moribia and hasn't been seen in Haram for a long time. Until the day he left, Lun always showed me a kind smile. But on that strange day, Lun showed me a twisted grin. Okay. Did I talk to you too? Uh, I couldn't even tell. Whatever. Let's fight. Or, let's not fight. Let's talk to these guys. Visitors, I'm sorry, but we are very busy right now. Please return to the dojo later. Much later. My name is Jane, sir. I know this will sound rude, but I happen to overhear the conversation with your students. Please, sir, I must find Lun and gain entry into the tournament. Was it talk such nonsense, girl? This is a matter of life and death. No, wait. You wear the outfit of a dancer, but I sense that it's more of a disguise. A yeah, disguise, disguise for a JJ, probably. I came here to settle things, teacher, once and for all. I will use my fist to confront my past. When I was a member of the Shadow Dragon Cult, the cult. Stand firm, both of you. Please, Jean, I would ask you to continue with your story. Capturing children and turning them into assassins. Lun, why? Jean, you cannot erase your past by defeating Lun, and you must realize that. So why do you wish to fight? I don't want to fight Lun to try and erase my past, teacher. I want to fight him because of what Hero taught me. Only by fighting Lun can... Lun, Lun can I confront my past. Accept it, and move on with my life. I had a brain fart. That is why I must fight Lun. That is why I must use this cursed martial art. And then, I will be free of it. All of it. Okay. Gene, if you intend to use the Shadow Dragon Fist, I cannot let you enter the tournament. The person who fights Lun must use the Blue Dragon Fist. Now hang on a minute, Dojo dude. Why can't Gene use the martial art she knows? Yeah, what's the difference? Blue Dragon, Shadow Dragon, it all looks the same to me. That's correct. The Blue Dragon Fist and the Shadow Dragon Fist are absolutely identical. What? The Blue Dragon Fist draws upon the light in a person's heart, and the Shadow Dragon Fist calls upon the darkness. They're two sides of the same coin. Ah. Only a person who has called upon light and darkness can master the Blue Dragon Fist. Boy, that sounds fucking crazy. Martial arts. The martial art you practice is not cursed, Gene. You have simply failed to notice. The martial art you use is the Blue Dragon Fist. I, well, wow! Gene, I choose you to represent our dojo in the tournament. I choose you, Gene! Use butt sucker! That, <laughs> that didn't come out right at all. I'm sorry. You did it, Gene! Blue Dragon Fist versus Shadow Dragon Fist, huh? The money's my money's on you, Gene. And when you're done beating Lun to a pulp, I'll go through his pockets and steal his silver. I would wish you luck in the tournament, Gene, but I know you're going to win. Thank you, everyone. 
Now then, Jane, while your outfit is pleasant, it is not suitable for the tournament. Giggity. Yeah, use the forest, Jane, exactly. Take one down like he's goddamn Sith, Sith Lord. Would you instead wear the uniform of our dojo? Of course I would. Thank you. Thank you, Jean. You there. Show her to the changing room. And try not to look at her titties. You probably did. You probably caught a glance, you know. Just, just sideways. Everyone's a pervert in this game. They just don't want to admit it. Once I tried to bury the past, but it will not be buried. The knowledge haunts me. I will deny it no more. And so it has come to this. I must now embrace what I once despised. The time has come to put aside the mask I have chosen to wear. I'm finished running away. This is my destiny. I'm slightly disappointed she don't have a dress on now, but, you know, it is what it is. Teacher, I promise to prove myself worthy of wearing this wonderful uniform. I know that you will, Jean. Here, take this. Alright, you got an invitation. I hope you will be able to achieve what I could not, Jean. I hope you can make Lun realize how much his quest for power has cost him. Don't worry, teacher. I'll show him the error of his ways in the back of my fist. Well said. Go now, Jean. And draw strength from your prayers. From our prayers. Battleground upon which the tournament will be held is due south of Haram. If you have trouble finding it, I will send a guide with you. Thank you, teacher, but I already know the way. It was my home long ago. Blunt's misuse of power is a disgrace to the blue dragon fist and to himself. You must make him understand the true meaning of martial arts. Cool. Yeah, man, this, this totally feels like the plot of a... of, like, an old, like, 60s uh, karate movie or something. Well, we should watch a karate movie at some point. Like, it don't have to be, you know, anytime soon. But it'd be kind of neat. I'm still laughing from that Bad Santa too yesterday. Like, that was... That was cool. So I, I actually looked it up because I was curious. You know, since that film's, you know, like six years old now, um, I looked it up if they were ever going to make a Bad Santa 3, which I really don't think they should. Like, I... You know what I mean? But uh, I looked it up on IMDb. Um, I guess the reasoning is basically the, the second film had absolutely bombed in the box office. Like, it barely made any money at all compared to the first film. So I... I don't I don't really count on it. But that's fine. You know. Third one would probably be a pile of shit anyway. Oh yeah, Cobra Kai, never die. Yeah. I've still been meaning to check out that Cobra Kai show, but it's like I I, I barely even remember like the second and third film of the Karate Kid anyways. So it's like I you know what I mean? I should probably watch those, you know, first. And whatever else, like, is in the Karate Kid universe that is, like, canon. Because I know they made a Karate Kid with a girl learning. Never seen that. And then I know they made one with uh, Jaden Smith, like, Will Smith's son, I'm pretty sure. Like, Jackie Chan was, like, his master. I Maybe because, like, the original guy died, you know? Um. But, yeah. Oh, okay, the girl one was with Hillary Swank. It was terrible. I, I've i never heard people say good things about it. I, I mean, I might just watch it once just to see how shit it is, but... Yeah. Alright, let's, uh, let's go to this temple here. Okay, they have a goddess statue here to fondle real quick. Oh, you gotta love the flags with, like, the skulls on top of them. Goddamn. 
Hehehe. <laughs> the tournament is soon to begin. Blood will fly gaudily. The weak will soon become the dead. But spectators like you are not allowed in this tournament. By order of Wong Li. How sad, I would like to watch all of you vomit as you witness the carnage. <laughs> We've come here to win this tournament, you sadistic pig. Take a look. <laughs> You're a curious girl, aren't you? Coming here in your pretty face to get your pretty face kicked in. I look forward to watching you bleed and hear your pathetic pleas for mercy. <laughs> uh, this is pretty fun, actually. Like I'm kind of looking forward to this tournament shit. You guys look like a bunch of weaklings. Are you sure you're not in the we Pee Wee tournament, bitch? Why don't you leave before the mommies, before your mommies start to worry about you? Okay. Turn off the lights because the party's over. We've already won this tournament. We've been training hard for the past week. We even threw up an extra set of push-ups. Been training hard the last week? Uh, I think Gene's been training hard the last, like, ten years. Our martial art is called the Assassin Fist. Mess with us, and you're as good as dead. Our training is somewhat, uh, Spartan, but we make up for it with our intensity. Uh, you can always spot a master of the Assassin Fist because he's covered with bruises. And this is odd, uh, as we walk along the streets of Haram, people often give us money. I think they're trying to bribe us into not killing them while we sleep. It's called charity, you basically naive dope. Yeah. This tournament is a single elimination format. Winners move on and losers go home. Usually in body bags. Yeah. For real. The best part is when she's at the monastery. Your money is on the bunny dojo. I'm kind of curious if that's uh, actually a thing or if it was just a troll. Like I expect just like a bunch of kid, uh, uh, like a bunch of chicks in like bunny outfits, you know, like kind of playboy bunnies. That'd be that'd be pretty sweet. There are eight teams in the tournament. And each team has three members. The last team standing earns the right to proclaim their art as the strongest. The first round of competition is about to begin. Is your team ready to fight? Uh, no. Give me a second, because uh, I wanted to talk to some more people. Here are the matchups for the first round. Uh huh. Match one: Gale Karate versus Bunny Karate. Giggity. Match two: Wolf Karate versus Drunken Karate. Match three: The Outsiders. I'm guessing that's us. Versus Assassin Karate. Match four: Armadillo Karate versus Shadow Dragon Karate. That's all. Okay. I'm the master of Wolf Karate and the leader of our pack. My wild blood runs hot with excitement. How? We are the users of Wolf Karate. Our martial art is based upon the attacks and movements of Wild Beast. Okay. Here, I think this Joker is a Wild Beast. He looks like a dog guy. I've had my fangs enlarged. Now I can bite into my foe's neck for a guarantee killed. It's one of the 12 secrets of Wolf Karate. Uh, you just told us your big secret, Wolf Boy, and it bites all right. This is great. Until now, the Shadow Dragon Fist has been the art of darkness. But this tournament allows us to spill blood without apology. <laughs> I guess that's one way of looking at it. Time has come to show the world that the Shadow Dragon Fist cannot be stopped. Oh, you're the fools who think you're going to beat Master Lun? Yeah, right. You're going to pay for your stupidity. One broken tooth and cracked rib at a time. I'll show you mercy, but Lun won't, be, won't let us be merciful to the weak. We're stupid. Or ugly, sorry. There's nothing so satisfying as striking your opponent in his unguarded face, feeling a spray of warm blood on your skin as your foe shrieks in pain. Victory brings me joy. Joy brings me strength. Strength brings me victory. Well, isn't this guy a sadist fuck? I haven't seen you since the Holy City, Gene. Are you here to fight in the tournament? Of course, I'm going to I'm going to defeat you and destroy the Shadow Dragon Cult forever. I won't let you steal the souls of any more helpless children. Such spirit, Gene. I don't think I ever would have seen you so focused before. Perhaps you will win. If I let you. <laughs> uh huh. Oh my. They literally are like Playboy bunnies. That's that's awesome. Hell, I'm almost win I'm almost wanting them to win. God damn. Hello there, we are warriors of the bunny fist. We're made up of mostly bored housewives who love to beat the snot out of our husbands. Ha! <laughs> oh my god. I'm going to use the bunny fist to bring order to this world. It's my goal to get every woman in the world to wear this outfit. Uh, I, I, again, I, I think I, I might bet my money on them too, just like Frog. And when they do, men will be so happy that there won't be any more wars or fighting. I don't think it would work quite like that. Well, it depends if the woman is ugly or not, I suppose. 
The secret of the bunny fist is to stun your male opponent with your beauty. <laughs> I mean, there could have been another way, like kick him the balls, but maybe that's the one rule that's not allowed. Once your foe is drooling, you can beat him up at your leisure. I'm even convinced that a few of our opponents even enjoy it. Probably. Check out my wares from all over the land and shop like it's the last day of your life. I mean, that's a quote right there. Oh, you actually sell a... A charm crest and a dream crest? Uh... I don't even know if I own those. Charm and dream. If I don't own one, I might actually buy one, but... Okay, I do have a dream crest. Cool. Pretty sure I don't have a charm crest. I might as well buy one. Check your crest guide. Ah. Fine. I mean, I can actually buy both, but I don't. I don't have that much money on me. Two crest combinations. Let's see. So. So, okay, well that's a, that's a different crest. Uh, you can use the Charm Crest for Goddess, but we don't have that yet. Oh. So apparently the Charm Crest uh, only is combination with the Goddess Crest, apparently. Huh. Ain't that a bitch. What was that other one? Sleep Crest? A dream. Dream Crest. Okay, again, the only combo you can do is between that and the Goddess Crest. So, I guess, sucks. I have no idea if this uh, NPC stays here or not. I you know what, fuck it. Let, let's actually buy a charm crest just because I have, because I can buy one. I guess I don't have one. Maybe charm is useful at some point. I don't know. Thank you. Shadow Dragon Cold is a bunch of losers, man. They are so going down. The defense of the armadillo fist is absolutely impenetrable. That's the essence of our art. If you can't be hit, you can't lose. My armor is amazing, isn't it? You've you've never seen iron plating this thick, I assure you. The only minor drawback is that I can't actually move while wearing it. In the blink of an eye, I can roll myself into a ball inside this iron armor. Then I just wait until my enemy gets bored. And then you attack him with the sword? What? Oh no, this armor is really itchy, so I use the sword to scratch my back. Boy, that's a strategy. Okay, I guess I'm ready for this shit then. First round of competition is about to begin. Is your team ready to fight? Hell yeah. Now then, which three members of your team will be fighting this round? Uh... I mean, yeah, obviously Gene will... will be on the team. Hero, yeah. Well, the third and final finer, fighter is... Gene, you don't have to ask. As the only guy left on the team, you have to choose me. Is it your way of thinking of... Uh, thinking a little, I don't know, piggish. Maybe you haven't heard, but women are quite capable of doing anything men can do. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Lamina. So I guess you I guess you should take my place. I'm glad to see you doing something so unselfish, by the way. You are aware that there isn't any prize money in this tournament, right? I mean, it's not wrong. No, no prize money. Well, Gene, good luck. Lucy and I will be right over here, cheering for all of you. I mean, that's fine. Huh, thanks, Ronfar. I needed a good lap to ease the tension. All right, you guys. I know it's only the first round, but fight with all your strength. Friendship. 
We can't afford to play it safe because we can't afford to lose. I mean, it's probably not too bad. Yes, I, I saved when I got to this little area. I don't need to talk to all those guys again. So if I lose, it's, it's fine. Okay, so we have the wolf. Wolf fist guys. Uh, oh, I could use battalion sword. That does good damage. Oh, no. Don't do that. Just smack that guy. Oh! Oh, so Gene actually learned a couple of moves then. Topple? Doppel dance? Call Gene's deadly doppelganger. That sounds kind of cool. And she could use the blue dragon palm. Gene's foes feels the bite. I kind of want to see what that does. Yeah, this is kick ass. Blue dragon nice. Oh, wow, these guys are actually a little tougher than I thought. Because that dragon pulse move burn, burn, did burn. goddamn 318 damage, but he's not dead. Fuck. Okay, maybe these guys count as bosses then. I thought they were just regular schnocks. Well, good thing I saved. Um, all allies protected from one spell. Well, that doesn't matter here, does it? Fuck it. I guess he's an Italian sword again, I suppose. Uh, you healed. You heal a little gene there. You do that doppel dance, I'm just curious. Like, does it make like a shadow clone or some shit? Dance! Okay. Burn, burn, yeah, burn! Yeah, kill him on the line there. There you go, there's two down. Nice. Yeah, I definitely got this third guy. The bag. Uh, I just hope it lets us heal between rounds. That's the only thing I'm kind of worried about with this. Huh. Oh, so the doppelganger basically, like, attacks twice, essentially? Huh. Well, that's pretty cool. Also, yay, you gained that level. Nice. Congratulations, your team has advanced to the second round. The other matches are still in progress, so I suggest you rest until we're ready to proceed. Well, hell yeah to that. Well, that was easy. Did those fools think it was a sparring match or what? No, those fools made no. F no, those fools made the mistake of getting into a fight with Hero. We can't get cocky, you guys. Not until we beat the Shadow Dragon Cult. And sounds like somebody died. What was that? Why did you bother to enter this tournament, you morons? Your skills are pathetic! Oh, uh, you... you have won. Please, please stop. Shut up! Fools like you are not allowed to speak in our presence! We reject your feeble attempt to surrender. Our victory must be absolute. Observe. Now do you understand the power of the Shadow Dragon Fist? Do you? What a dick. Why did they do that, Gene? They already won the match! That's the nature of Shadow Dragon Karate Hero. Members of the cult hunger for blood. They don't want to win, they want to kill. Asshole. Let's fondle the goddess statue for, uh, for comfort. Because I'm, I'm not shaking. I think I'm actually gonna make a... Yeah, let's, let's make another save here. Make a save where the white dragon cave from last stream. Screw it. There's no mer there's no mercy in this dojo, says Frog. Yep. Got that right. Alright, next uh next opponents. Don't know who we're facing, but it don't matter. The match began. Flash ninjas? Uh I think I remember seeing these guys. Oh whatever. Uh, actually, hell, you know what? I might as well just focus on one dude. Do that doppel dance though. That shit's cool. Gypsy dance. 
should have checked the rankings. Eh. I don't think it matters that much. Dodge this. Yeah, dodge that, bitch. These guys are kind of thick on the HP pool, it looks like. That has at least 400 health on them, goddamn. Okay, if they're all aligned in a row, there's no reason not to use Battalion Blade on them. So let's go ahead and, uh, her Battalion Sword. Go ahead and heal, uh... Go ahead and heal Gene. Do the Blue Dragon Palm on you, I guess. Yeah, that battalion sword's just gonna hit that guy there. I fucked burn, that up. Burn, burn. At least he's dead, so. Happy hour! Yeah, happy hour. Doppelganger can kick some ass still. Bitch, need one more now. We got, we got this. Yeah, hero, he recovers 55 HP there from those rings. So I think they do stack, actually. Which is pretty sick. Oh, so that's a regular attack. Oh my god, did she just hit three times? Holy shit! She has hella good speed, I guess, if she can hit three times. Also, I got a thousand XP there. That was, that was pretty cool. That's pretty cool. God damn. Congratulations, your team has advanced to the final round of the tournament. Your opponent is the Grand, Ch grand Champion match, or the Shadow Dragon Call. I was hoping someone would take care of those homicidal maniacs for us. But I guess we'll have to take care of them ourselves. She says with a smile. Suggest just using Jean's normal attack. Well, the shadow, uh, not the, the, the blue fist attack, that does almost 300 damage. The normal attacks did 70. I mean, 70 times three is what, 210 or something? Something like that. Or no. 250? 230? Something like that. I mean, there's only one more round anyway. Screw it. Yeah, tell, yeah, tell me the second round results. Fuck it. Match one. Shadow Dragon Karate defeated Bunny Karate. Oh, they murdered all the bunnies. Oh, that's sad. That's sad, bro. Match two, the Outsiders defeated Wolf Karate. Is it us? Yeah, that's that's pretty sad. Tell me about the final round, yeah. Oh, it would just be me versus them. Good luck against Master Lun. If you're really lucky, he might even let you live. Yeah, I'm sure he will. Yeah, that's that sucks though. They killed the bunny girls. Or did they? Are they still standing? Uh, oh, I guess they're alive? They must have spared them. Because they were hot. We did everything by the book. Tight outfits, seductive winking, shoving our asses in their faces. <laughs> Nothing worked, but at least they didn't do to us what they did to those other guys. As it is, I think I might have ruptured an implant. Well, better than dying. Those guys from the Shadow Dragon Cult didn't even care that we were girls. I wore my tightest outfit. They didn't even stop to enjoy the view. I don't think they remove certain parts before they join the cult, do you? Oh my god. I don't even wanna I don't even wanna imagine that. Also, holy shit, uh let's get rid of this guy. Bye bye. It's been at least a week or two since I got one of those bot things. 
Those fighters of the Shadow Dragon Fist were frightening. Their eyes were so empty. Probably. But yeah, at least they at least they didn't kill the bunny chicks. I I actually give them a little bit more respect for that. Save over that thing again. Alright, final round here. Although I expect we're gonna face Master Lon in a you know, in a sec. Let's fight, bitch. Start the final battle. It's funny. I thought I'd be a little scared of those Shadow Dragon guys, but for some reason I can't stop laughing. Weird, huh? It's not weird at all, Ronfar. I think it's very normal to laugh in the face of death. Okay. I can't succumb to the hatred I feel for Lun. For if I do, he's already won the fight. I will defeat Lun with Blue Dragon Karate. I will dissolve the darkness with light. Okay. Let's, uh, let's, let's do that. Okay, Shadow Assassins. Uh. Yeah, might as well just use the Poe Sword on. Use the Poe Sword on the guys who aren't Super Saiyans right now, so. Just bash him over the head. Get that doppelganger out. Because that's actually a cool. Gypsy move. Dance! This guy's really trying to fuck up Ronfar here. I don't really appreciate it. God damn. Shadow Clone Jutsu. I mean, it. it's not quite like that. It's more like she makes, like, kind of a phantom that kind of hovers around her. I mean, honestly, it's like she has a goddamn stand from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. That's what it kind of reminds me of. Shit, Ronfar's gonna get his ass killed again. Uh, well, shit, I should... Italian sword here. Get them both. Probably. Uh, okay, I just thought of something. If if Jean has first priority, couldn't I... If, yeah, I could give a healing edge to far and he can survive. Yeah, let's do that. Because the doppelganger will still punch people in the face, so... Italian sword, all those, all those three burn, guys there. Burn, burn. Nice. These guys are some tough sons of bitches, aren't they? Sword again. Ronfar. Try to kill everybody. Jean. Take care of that guy down there. Probably be dead. No? Damn, how much health do these guys have? Like a thousand each? Burn, Jesus Christ. Burn, burn. Tough sons of bitches? I think fuck I'm healing everybody here in a sec. I also thank god that I have a much better group healing spell now. Heals basically everybody. Almost back to full. God sakes, dude. Keep spamming that battalion sword, I guess. Shit. Make sure everything's healed. I'm just curious, are all... Okay, none of these dances are going to be useful against them. I, I don't think so. Take care of that Super Saiyan guy there. Thank you. He's dead. Oh, there, I guess there's another Super Saiyan there. Oops. Well, sec this second guy should get wrecked here with his sword. Burn, burn, burn. Good. Okay, one more left. We got this. I was just a little bit worried because of how tanky they are, but we're gonna, we're gonna clap everyone's cheeks today. Just, just do regular attack there, too. Okay, we got the 
There we go. Got him. 1689 XP. Nice. Kind of sucks Lamina is uh, missing out on work XP again, but whatever. Amazing! The winners of this tournament are Jean and her friends. I knew we could do it, Hero. The Shadow Dragon Cult never had a chance. We could do it, Ruby? All I remember, all I remember you doing is sitting on your little pink butt. Did you say something, Ron Farr? I didn't think so. Uh-huh. Uh, now I'm sure, uh, Lun is gonna be pretty fucking pissed off. So maybe we should model the statue and save up again. Who knows what he's gonna do. Okay. Let's go see the jackass. I knew you would win, Jean. You are still the finest I have ever produced. Jean, you still haven't come to realize the truth, have you? Silence, Lun. It's time for you to make good on your promise and fight me. Ma, Jean. The martial arts are nothing more than an efficient way to terminate opposers. Power is not a reward. It's a jewel to be snatched from the weak and foolish. As one of my former students, you should know this better than anyone else. You always were the bright one. The only way to defeat me is to compromise your principles by using my karate of death. Join me again, Jean. I know that's what you want more than anything. <laughs> You're wrong, Lun. Your worm-infested heart hides the truth from your eyes. Power grows when spread amongst the many, and perishes when hoarded by a few. I intend to show you the power of free will by delivering a crushing blow to you in the tournament. Okay. Guess I need to maybe save again. I didn't think they were gonna go uh, voice acting route there. That's cool. So, well, we just talk to him again, then? If I win, you will no longer use the Shadow Dragon Fist. You will no longer take children from their homes and train them to in, in your twisted art. Ha ha ha, very well, Gene. If you win, I will forsake the Shadow Dragon Fist forever. But what incentive do I have to win, Gene? Besides the utter satisfaction of killing you. Of course, if I win, I will be allowed to claim the lives of all your friends. Well, Gene, are, you, are your friends willing to place their faith in you? Ha ha ha. All of you, please, entrust me with your lives. Uh, can I just lend it to you G instead? Don't worry, Gene, I know you're gonna win. Well, why don't we all just fight with Gene, just to make sure? Good idea, right? I appreciate the offer, Ron Farr, but I have to do this myself. Yeah, she gotta put on her big big girl pants, I guess. Don't worry, Ron Farr, I know Gene is going to win, because our faith makes her strong. And also the fact that she has a bunch of protection shit on her. Gene, the course you have chosen has has placed the future of this world in your hands. If you lose here, the entire world will feel the pain of that defeat for eternity. Don't worry, Lucia. I've waited too long for this moment, and I don't intend to lose. Lon, this is your last fight. Indeed. Watch me get my ass handed me easily. Okay, let's see what we have here. Uh... I mean, he's definitely not going to fall for any of these dances. I, I could make that doppelganger. That might help. I don't know how long that lasts. Gypsy dance! But, like, any more damage output, I'm willing to, I'm willing to do it. Okay, he decided to jump in the air and fucking smack me. Okay. Cool. Take one more hit. Let's use the blue dragon palm, see what that does. Blue dragon palm! 299? Pretty good, pretty good. Okay, he does some shitty ass combo there. Okay. Uh, 
Looks like he's on guard now, I guess. Thought I got a bunch of these healing nuts. Gift of power! Yeah, Jean's gonna have some nuts in her mouth now. Oh, he made a fucking shield, apparently? Oh, oh! That was kind of cool, actually. Not gonna lie. Kind of curious. What does a normal just smacking him do? 47, 51, 51. Yeah, I'll just I'll just do the blue thing because that's more than the 150 I just inflicted on him. So what? This motherfucker buffs himself? Oh, that's fucking. That's fucking stupid. That is fucking dumb. Also, apparently that doppelganger thing wore off already. Yeah, that sucks to ass. Heals himself and buffs his defense. Fuck off. Uh, there's another healing nut, I guess. I kind of feel like maybe I should have gave her two healing rings instead of the protect and the fucking doll thing. But, you know. How much is that one technique again? Doppel dance? 16? I guess that's not too bad. Gypsy dance! You know, I wouldn't doubt if there's a more advanced version of this that, that allows, like, two or three of those things to appear. That'd be pretty sweet. Yep. Less damage, but I don't even care. As long as I can kill him. Oh, I, I, I forgot to use the other technique. I fucked up. Whatever. He's gonna hit me with that sphere thing now, isn't he? Yeah. Fuck. Well, thank fuck I can strike first. Let me use a, uh... Use a healing nut here. Yeah, thank god I go first. Gift of power! So the highest hit he could do is a 109, basically. I'll have to keep that in mind. Oh, he's gonna heal himself again, dude. God damn it. Raises his defense even more. Come on. That's just that's just that's just dumb. Blue, draw, blue dragon palm, whatever the hell that does even now. I mean he raised his defense goddamn 80, 80 points or something. Okay, doing that karate shit again, I see. Yeah, I definitely see why you uh, suggested the two Chiro Press for, for this tournament shit. But I, I'd probably still keep it on on her for just like other battles throughout the game. I'd probably swap it out for certain bosses though. But I mean, if she's a Karate Master now, shit. I could turn her into an all-out warrior soon. Oh shit, I need to heal up. He would have wiped me out if I didn't heal, so. Oh, uh, the battery. Apparently my battery's low for my PS3 controller. It should be fine for the rest of the stream, though. There's that palm thing. Kind of running low on MP. I hope this guy's almost fucked. Stop doing the. I should probably stop doing the the shadow clone thing. I don't. I don't ever think it's worth it. It seems to only last for two turns, anyways. 
Maybe it's dependent on how much damage I take from the enemy rather than the turns that it's out. Stop healing, bro. Fucking asshole. You're really starting to piss me off. Probably have to redo this fight again. Oh! Oh shit, I got him! Well, hell yeah! Huh. He like, he just all of a sudden he like, you know, kneeled to the ground and was like, oh, I did it, never mind. Good amount of XP, 8,800 XP. Nice, nice. Yeah, fuck you, bitch. I hope he doesn't have a second form or anything like that. Well, well done, Gene, but how did you use the Blue Dragon Fist? I never taught you anything about that art. My technique hasn't changed at all, Lun. It's my heart that has changed. I use the skills you taught me, but I don't use them to kill. I use my skills to fight for my friends, and for the future. I don't know if it's the Blue Dragon Fist. I don't know if it even has a name. I just entrust my body to the warmth and the strength that I feel in my heart. I believe that I would become invincible if I cut off my own emotions, but you... You grow strong by drawing upon your emotions and by placing your faith in others. I don't understand, but I cannot overcome your strength and I must acknowledge your power. Good, bitch. Lon, please give us the aura of the Blue Dragon. Here it is yours. Do it as, do as you wish with it. I have no use for it anymore. Okay. The cave in which the Blue Dragon sleeps is to the north of here. The revival of Zophar means nothing to me, nor do I care about the Blue Dragon. I obeyed all things chosen only so that I could devote myself to fighting. <laughs> I just recalled something that my teacher, Wang Li, once told me. He said there is no way to teach the Blue Dragon Fist, but that you would know when you have mastered it, because you would feel it in your heart. I don't understand what he meant, but now... I must retrain myself. I want to feel what you do, Jean. Your words will remain with me forever, Jean. Engraved on my heart. Uh, I mean, that's all well and good, but like, let's let's not forget that he like was kidnapping children and training them to kill. Like, shouldn't he maybe go to jail or something like that? I don't know. Maybe I'm just being fucking crazy again. Anyway, so yeah, we're the best. Like no one ever was. Save after that for sure. Um, so I, I mean, I guess we have to go back to Haram and, and say, "Hey, we we kicked his ass." Blah blah blah. I guess. There's nothing. There's nothing else here, right? I mean, we got the aura. So, hey, what the hell's over here? Oh, there's a building here. I didn't even notice. Oh, huh. gee, you defeated them. We all you. Oh, these are the children. I guess he took or whatever. We all of you are alive, so if there's anything I can do for you, just please take care of these kids. I still have one more fight. You defeated the masked man? Thank you, Jane. You set us all free. We don't have to study this horrible art anymore. What, I don't have to practice anymore? Hooray! Uh, what should I do now? I just overheard I just heard of your victory. Congratulations. Many of us are free for the first time since we were born. I just I just hope my parents haven't forgotten about me. Gene, did you beat them? Thank you, Gene. Can you help me sit up? I can't move. Rest now, little guy. No one's going to hurt you anymore. Yeah. It's kind of neat. You can actually talk to the children. I, I guess they were uh, here for some reason. Bunnies have anything to say about it? We're always looking to enroll new students of the Bunny Fist. How about you, Sister Golden Hair? Care to join us? Are you kidding? No amount of money could get me to wear that getup. So you're saying you'll wear that outfit for free? I just knew you were going to make a comment like that, Ronfar. I know you're not as pretty as I am, Lamina, but I think you'd look okay in that costume. Yeah, I bet. You guys totally kicked some major butt today. Say, Jean, do you think you could join us? Our, our uniform would look great on you. Yes, it would. 
Uh, I'm sorry, but I don't think I could fight in that. The bunny fist is strong, but I have to admit that you guys are much stronger. Your fashion sense, however, could use a lot of work. Eat a dick. I knew you could do it, Gene. You're always Lund's best pupil. Now the children can finally go home. Thank you, Gene. There's no more Shadow Dragon Cult? Now I don't have to train anymore. Thanks, lady. When I become a singer, I'll write a song about you and your friends. Hell yeah, we got a fucking ballad in the works made about us. What? Master Lund was beaten? Uh, forgive me, Gene. I wasn't doing this because I wanted to. Master Lund made me do it. Promise me you'll never do anything like this again. And I might not kick your rotting teeth in. I promise, I promise. I'll change my ways. Don't hurt me! Bitch. Alright, now let's, uh... Now let's get out of here. I mean, I could talk to the other people, but... I don't really care, to be honest. I had to talk to the bunny chicks, though. Obviously. I had to get them digits. So, they said north of here? Oh, this must be the cave. Um, uh, I mean, I'll be honest. I probably don't have time to actually get through the whole cave. But it hasn't even been two hours yet. Well... Eh. Let's go back to Haram, I guess, and just let... I don't even know if we have to do this or not. Don't be a bitch! Do the cave! Well, if it takes over an hour, then I'll be playing it until midnight, which... No one will be awake then, so... Okay, yeah, he said go see... go see Wong Lee. Okay. Let's go see Wong. But yeah, I'm pretty sure y'all are gonna go to bed soon anyway, so, like, do I really wanna... Not do that when people aren't watching. Oh, Lun said all that? All oh, you have done very well. I thank you a thousand times. Now my doji can have the shame of Lun's misuse of power lifted from it. Yes, I'm the one who taught Lun before he became drunk with power. Thank you for showing him the truth. Now this old man can rest a little easier. Yeah. Wow, you defeated Lun? Well, you're just a girl with skinny arms. You shouldn't have won. Gene, I, I said some pretty rude things about you. I was an enormous butthead, and I asked for your forgiveness. I don't care what you said about me, because I always had my had my friends' support. Yep. If we serve our land with purity of heart and of purpose, our land will prosper. Perhaps now, one understands this. Thank you, Gene. Okay. Yeah, we didn't need to actually talk to the dude here, but just... I don't know, it just felt appropriate. <laughs> yeah, we'll at, least, uh, we'll at least look at the cave for a bit. I, I really don't think I can get through it. I really think it would take, like, at least an hour to get through the whole thing. But we'll kind of see what the gimmick is. Uh, okay, so... So, FYI, tomorrow, I believe Dragon is busy. So, no Astroneer. Um... I'm trying to think of what I'm doing tomorrow. I mean... Scouting for more jobs, obviously. I might actually go to Dollar General to get more cheese, because I'm out of cheese. <laughs> that sounds weird. Going to Dollar, Dollar General for some cheese. Like, I would have gotten some cheese earlier in Chiefs, but they, uh... It's... It, it, their, their cheese is, is expensive. Like, it's like... You know, deli. They don't. They don't. They don't have cheese like you know Sargento or or like Kraft or anything like that. So at least I've never seen it there. The are those sharks? What the hell are those things? Oh, tiger sharks and water elementals. Okay. Interesting. Okay, I really appreciate. Oh, so she can. So so she keeps the dances, and she can use the the blue dragon technique still. That's pretty cool. I don't know if a blue dragon palm attack would work well on an ice elemental. I guess we'll find out. I'd expect fire techniques to do really good in this dungeon.
Okay, yeah. Oh, the blue dragon thing does pretty do good, pretty damn good damage. So wow, I effectively have a, uh, I effectively have a uh, three great warriors now. I guess that's pretty sweet. Like I didn't think Jean would actually be base. I mean, she basically became a monk, which is pretty sick. Okay, that flame shot annihilates those those uh, sharks. I guess she always hits three times then now. That's cool too. Yay, Gene is level 36. Oh, Blue Dragon Kick was learned. Sick. Gene streaks across the battlefield. That sounds pretty cool. Here we're getting some sick techniques here, guys. definitely have enough money to get whatever I, I want from Haram. So. God damn it, they're not too far back. Mega magic yeah, magic! Kill that shark thing. That bitch up! I don't think I've ever seen that move before. A thunder blow? Huh. Oh, I should probably switch out that uh, thief staff that Lamina has uh, equipped. Probably give her the Hellfire staff. Those are in our ice cave and all that. Let's do something. There you go, Hellfire staff. Okay. Oh, looks like another one of those wizard guys over there. Now, I don't know why the sharks sound like dolphins. When they're sharks, that's a little bit... Unless tiger sharks actually make a noise like that, which... I'd have no fucking idea about. Blue dragon kick. Is that a single target hit? I just I, I don't know what that looks like. Oh, that looks sick, bro! Holy shit! It, it, it's basically like a like a battalion sword, pretty much. That thing's hella powerful. do is probably uh, rearrange some of these starting positions here. Um, I mean, r really, I should have probably... I should probably have Gene, Ron Farr, and uh, Hero, like, right at the very front, honestly. have Lamina, I guess, a pretty far ways back. Oh, we can actually change her position, too? We can, we can change Lucia's position? I did not know that. I just, I guess, have her right there. That should be good. Give me a sec, I gotta, I gotta go to the bathroom.
that. Uh, I, I went to the bathroom frog, that's where I was at. I mean, yeah, I ain't gonna be going much longer here. I, I really do not feel like going through this whole thing tonight. I just kind of wanted to check out what was going on here. Kind of tired, actually. Probably because of that workout earlier. What the fuck is that thing called? A Doom Rigger? Okay, that's a... Uh... Interesting design. Yeah. So I'm fucking hit up. Ugh. Dodge this. Wait, did that thing just spawn in like other things to kill? I really hope not. Mega Magic Flame! It's like it just spit out a bunch of larvae or something. Destruction! Oh no. <laughs> They're called scurvy slugs. Yeah, that's probably not good. Uh, I'd like to get rid of all those slugs right now, if I can. Okay. All these other slugs, maybe? Ferocious wind! pillar by killing one of these slugs, but like I had no idea how much defense that they had, so holy shit though, over three thousand XP points? That's nuts, dude. Three thousand thirty-five hundred eleven experience points. Wow. Also got a thousand silver too. I have a feeling those things will be great for grinding, which I'm kinda tempted to do. Yeah, Lamina's now 36. Nice. Magic Swiper was learned. Lamina pilfers an enemy's MP. That's probably a good move. Probably a good move. Oh, I was about to say, oh, I can hop over these stones? That's great, I guess. See, it looks like there's a goddamn genie over there that wants to fight me. You want to go, bitch? I'll fucking go. Okay, that's an aqua assassin, apparently. Okay. Let's take down the uh, other thing. sword is still like really useful in this game. It's like wasn't that like the second technique I ever got? Mega magic flame! Yeah, it's still reliable, it's pretty sweet. Did you try stealing here? What, is there such a thing as an assassin crest? Is, is that what you're talking about? Or or an aqua crest? Is there an aqua crest? Is that, does that exist? Water crest? I mean, there probably is a, a, a certain crest I can get here via stealing or otherwise. 
this point, I really should try to get at least one of every crest in the game. As far as I am along in the story, is like, I'm level 36, been playing this game uh, like 30, 30 hours, something like that. Okay, I think that's uh, supposed to open up somehow, that waterfall. Ooh, I got a hurricane staff, that's pretty sweet. Guessing it's a slightly better water staff. The, the blue dragon right there. Just flame shot. Man, that fucks them up really good. This. Like the Scorpion song? Yeah. Okay. Of course I need to see uh, Hurricane Staff in action. Dolphin, I guess we gotta kill. Or, uh, shark. I just say dolphin, because that's what they sound like. And that's actually what, kind of what they look like, too. What the hell? Sometimes we just attack manually if there's only four of these people. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. But yeah, like, if I could find, like, a boatload of all those, um, uh, whatever the hell that thing was that spawned all those slugs, if, if I could find, like, a whole group of them, I could level up pretty fucking quickly there. Because, goddamn, 3,500 experience? Mega Magic Flame! That's nuts. Hey. I kind of hope that enemy responds back in that, in that spot. My branch of this cave. There we go. Now I think about it, Ronfar and uh, Hero, they're probably not too far from level 37 now, are they? Eh, somewhat. Somewhat. But also, interesting factoid, um, pretty much everybody except for Lamina now has over 100,000 experience. So that's neat. Looks like there's another chest over there. I'm having the hiccups for the weirdest reason. Okay, so it's just over there. I want it. I want it really bad. Fuck. Guess I gotta fight for it. Thought I could just steal it and, you know, like, be on my merry way, but no. Not really. Let's actually use a post sword on uh, this jackass. Shot on the back. Dodge this. Okay. Man, guy shoot. Guy just shot like an Aurora beam at everyone. Ice move from Pokemon. We must hold together. Okay, kill that thing, kill that thing, kill that thing. And kill that thing. He's 
basically kill everything. worth it, dude. I could just buy that anywhere. Lame. See, I'm getting a little bit of silver. 85, 8, I'd like 10,000, but, you know. At least 10k. I don't want to fight that dolphin thing, dude. Damn it. Damn it! Damn it, Bobby. Let's kill that thing. Kill that thing. Oh, what? Oh, I, <laughs> I totally forgot you had this shit. Uh, yeah, Lamina, she has the... The combination magic, it looks like. Boy, some of these look kind of sick. We've got lightning rain. Bolts of something or another. We got plasma shock, radiation eruption. We got wind cutter, a brutal, ble a brutal ble a brutal breeze. I've got squall, which I believe, uh, I believe Hero had at some point. And I have thunder tornado, attack of wind and thunder, at a costly 25 MP. Boy, I kind of want to try that. Fuck it, let's try a Thunder Tornado. I don't even care. Like, we're about to get out of this cave anyway, so I don't care about wasting a bunch of energy. Shit, Thunder Tornado sounds really fucking OP. There, fuck. Lamina's kind of the shit now, huh? Ultimate black mage up in this, up in this bitch. Get more things to hop on, like a goddamn frog. Oh, there's another one of those uh, thingies. Probably get me another level up here. Wait, can I not? Wait a sec. I was about to say, why is Lucia so low on health? What the fuck? Yeah, heal her up too, dude. Yeah, I want the experience from this thing. So I actually kind of want it to spam all those slugs. I'll just kill him with an AoE spell or something. Doom Rigger, that, that I forgot what it was called. Okay, so I guess it just launches them like the first second it gets, pretty much. Okay. Destruction. Uh, I think doesn't wipe it out. Let's use a. Uh... XP, I'm pretty damn sure here is gonna get to level 37. Then. Oh wow, the Doom Rigger, the, the Doom, act, the Doom thing actually like ran away. Burn, I don't think it burn, could do that. Burn. It should still get XP from its uh, spawn though, right? Huh. Magic power recover. Maybe 
Jab would get like half the XP. Just come and spawn. Oh, so is the okay, it's the Doom Rigger that's actually worth the most. Because all the slugs combined, uh it's only like five hundred. Okay. Huh. So it's the opposite of what I thought, pretty much. You just gotta kill the Doom Rigger pretty fast, I guess. Okay, keep that in mind for next time. I don't know how long this cave is. I'm almost tempted to just like like maybe say make another file of this and like just save that for next stream. Cause like it already seems like we're kind of a distance in. Then again, I'd like to spend some money on supplies, like get more healing nuts and shit. And I could probably use the extra experience anyway. Let's just go a little bit further. Let's see who's uh, who's streaming right now. has anybody else to stream, I'm willing to hear it. on us? What the fuck? It's a dolphin thing, bro. No, you don't have anybody in mind, frog. I'll just browse here in a bit. After I kill these guys. HP there, bud, but it's okay. Don't. Fuck off. Fuck off, dolphin. Fuck off. Anti-magic ring? That might come in handy. It might. I mean, if it highly resists magic, yeah, could work. Anti-magic ring. These guys, that guy, put that dude over there, shoot a flame at that thing. I'm glad these, um, I'm glad these medium fireball things only cost 8 MP. Because I'm sure soon enough Lamina is going to get like a, like a high level fireball spell that's going to cost like fucking 16 or some nonsense. And it'll be completely overkill on some of these dudes. Take care of you, take care of you. Get wrecked. Dun, 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 dun. Cave thingy. Okay. The dolphin thing. Fuck's sakes with all these dolphins. 
Uh, you know what? I think I'm just going to yeet out of here. I don't really care going through... I, I don't really mind going through all this shit again. At least I can go back to town and, like, buy some supplies with some... How much money I got? 10,300? Yeah. I can just come back and, uh... I'll try to remember, like, this particular spot, and then when I play Lunar 2 again, I'll just start at this room. I think that's that's fine. I'll have to remember that room, of course, but... Back into town real quick... Fondle that statue like you wouldn't believe. Might as well buy the supplies prior to next stream, I guess. So, max on those nuts, because I said so. There we go. Huh, that's like a third of our shit, but that's fine. It's fine. It's just 7,000. I think I wanted to buy one piece of armor or something. Damn sure I didn't need to buy a weapon. So I think there's only yeah, there's only three weapons here anyway. Jewel gauntlet? Is that much? Oh, okay, you already have it all. I get maybe it's the prayer bandana? I I mean I guess I'll get that for on fire, sure. Defense 145 to 148, and adds a Wisdom and Magic Defense. Yeah, it's probably worth 1260, screw it. Yeah, I think that's all I needed. Oh, Bejeweled Bracelet, 1890, eh. Raises defen defense by 5, sure, whatever. I'm probably getting spoiled by all this shit. Oh, huh. Now I can sell the safety helmet. I think I'm actually going to keep the safety helmet, because it's hilarious. I think that that, that that offers good protection. We'll sell those other things. Oh, shit, we got to sell that fan, too. That razor fan. Uh, where's the thing again? Oh, yeah, sell the jewel. Gauntlet. Find a bracelet, yeah. Keep the safety helm, because that's cool. Okay. Alright, cool. Got 6,000 to use for whatever, I guess. Okay, let's see who's out there. I'm probably going to have to raid a rando somewhere. something actually fun, maybe, huh? Let's see, Fortnite shit. Jack Park, no. Eve Online, no. League of Legends, nope. Oh, ple people playing that new Crisis Core thing, like Dragon is. That's why it's there, I guess. No. There's a guy called Captain Shiggles playing Final Fantasy IX. Uh, he's got he's got like seven viewers. Screw it. Oh, 
Oh, wow, he's actually a smaller stream than me. Yeah, I'll rate him. Captain Shiggles. That is a funny name. Yeah, good stream indeed. Let's see around Frog. They're gonna raid Captain Shiggles. Uh, I guess he's trying to do a like, follower goal. He's actually missing a he's actually missing a follower for his goal, so that's kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, I thought I'd help a guy smaller than me, so. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you later.